<sighs> right. It's time to head off, I think. If we hear gunshots, we're heading after you. <laughs> anything else? There is something strange, though. Um... What do you... what do you mean? I actually feel good about this. I, I think it's gonna go well. Oh, that <laughs> right. Weirdly enough, yeah. Well, we call you Premonition for a reason. Yeah, well, maybe it's time to retire that name. Well, if your feeling is right, I mean, you might as well stay as Primo, yeah? <sighs> Be safe. Okay, protect TJ. Come on, you know I will. We're gonna be okay. I... I love you. <laughs> it's about time. I love you too. It's taken me so long to say that. I know it has, but um, I think even without telling each other, I, I, I think we knew it. I'll see you soon, okay? All of you. I'll see you all later, okay? Take care of the dogs, okay? I know you're all kind of cautious of them and keeping an eye on them, and that's, that's fair enough, but... I honestly don't think they're going to do anything, okay? So, just keep an eye on them, and um, hopefully everything should go to plan, okay? Right, TJ. It's time to head out, then. Are you ready? Okay, I'll see you all when I see you, I guess. Right, TJ, you with me? Yeah, okay. Right. Okay, there's a few... There's a few hairs around here, so... I need to keep an eye out. Well, I mean, we don't really need to worry about them, but it's the ghouls I'm kind of concerned about. Okay. The hairs are gonna be fine. It's good to see that they're actually still in this area, to be fair. So, I'd imagine most of the babies have, have sort of grown up by now, I guess. So, it's probably for the best that I did leave the babies and didn't take them for food. Which, to be fair, would have been pretty pointless, all things considered. It's so easy to get lost in here, TJ. So, just stay behind me, alright? Oh, okay. Yeah, stay behind me. It's, it's easy to get lost in here. You'll be surprised how many people used to get lost in here before, let alone now, I mean, it's so much more dangerous now, considering there could be a ghoul behind any one of these trees. Strange that the hares don't seem to be scared of us either, but I suppose there's better things to be scared of right now, so... Okay. Oh! I see the road. Okay, we made it. It's a good thing I used to go through these woods a lot, huh? Okay. So we've got the shops. Um, okay, um, oh, <sighs> gotta admit, it's, it's weird seeing this area again after so long, I mean, <laughs> I spent my entire life growing up here, and to not be here for so long, it's, it's good to be back, it's really good to be back, but, okay, I'm gonna get my gun out just in case, because, if it's not Walt on the gate, then, I don't know, I think anyone on the gate should be fine as long as it's not Reed, I think. I think that's the, that's the main point, right? Anyone but Reed. Because I think maybe I can get through to them and maybe make them understand that we can take this place back from Reed, I, th I think. That's the main goal, but okay. I see someone. Let's get behind the trees, okay? Um, let's see. Get my binoculars out. It's a good thing I found these. See, they haven't actually upgraded any of the barricades. They're still pretty bad. Um, okay. Let's have a look. Um... Okay, who's there? I can't really... Ah! It's Walt. Okay. Okay, we're good. Yeah, they haven't changed who's on guard, so... Maybe it's not the best idea to come out of the trees, so... 
maybe we should just go back this way and then actually come out out in the open. I think that's probably a good idea. Yeah, this is probably for the best. It's good. It's Walt and Liana, I think, right? <sighs> uh, hello. Um, we're here, I guess. Um, I don't really know what to say. Hi, what are you doing here? Um, uh, did you think that we wouldn't come back? I, I figured you would, I just didn't think it would be this soon. It, it's been seven, nearly eight months, Walt. That's too long. Well, what do you want? What do you mean, what do I want? My family is in there. My friends, I'm here to come home. Reed won't let you back. You know that. Yeah, I know, but... He's not going to be making decisions anymore. You think you can take over? No, I think we can. All of us. Together. Brent, we... What has he got that scares you all so much that you just all fall in line, huh? A few of us fought back, okay, tried to defy his orders, and because of that, four of us are being held in cells right now, your brother being one of them. The rest of us were warned that if we attempted anything, we'd end up right with them. Th that's all? Being threatened with getting locked in a cell? You haven't been down there. No light, minimal food, barely any water. I I'd rather do what he says. Yeah. And look where you are now. Both of you. What kind of life is this? Huh? Just following orders and doing whatever you're told. I you know what? I'll answer that. It isn't. Okay? I honestly don't know what to say to you, Brent. We can't let you in. Me, Primo, TJ, Rosia, John. Reed sent us all to Pigton. And do you know what he did to us? Uh, Reed never really said much, but gave us a general idea. Even threatened a few of us with being sent to him. Yeah, well... Sure, Reed told you a small amount, but not everything. Picton would experiment on us, torture us for the fun of it, inject us with toxins and God knows what else. He mutilated us, cut us, assaulted us, he even let his guards violate us. So you can't begin to imagine what that was like! Brent, we... We didn't know. Not exactly, but... You knew what Reed did. <laughs> Does my family even know? N no. M most people believe you're all dead. Only the people he brought to the meetings with Pigton knew what really happened. So my family believe that I'm dead. That's that's what Reed told them, but but they don't believe him. It, it's the reason why Drake is in a cell. <laughs> okay, then do me a favor, Walt, and just do nothing. I can't do that. You saw what he did to Jonah and Josie. I am not letting him get away with that, okay? I understand, but if we let you in, if you let us in, nothing happens. Nothing, because I will stop him. You can't promise us that. If you fail to do whatever you plan to do, he will find out and he will make us pay for it. <laughs> you know what? No, you're right, okay? I can't promise you that it'll go perfectly, but I can guarantee you that things will change around here. 
like what? For starters, you'll actually be able to call this place a home and not some prison camp that you're being forced to work at. Not only that, but you'll actually have people you trust and people that you don't fear making the decisions and being in control. <sighs> okay. Alright. The side gate is unlocked. Just... Just head in. But, if you get caught, I had nothing to do with this. Neither did Liana. Got that? <laughs> Understood. And Brent? Where's Primo, Rosia, and John? They're close. But they won't be coming until Reed is under control. Okay. And, um... I'm sorry. Don't be. This was him. Just. Him. Okay. You with me? <sighs> okay. Well... That was harder than... Oh, 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 I forgot about the cameras. That was... Ah, I should shut the gate as well, probably. That way, no ghouls can get in. Okay, um... I don't know whether to say that was harder or easier than I thought. I think it was... about what I expected, but... It's good to know that... the fact that change is going to happen around here is enough to make them... Join us, so... Okay. And I swear, this place looks worse than it did when we left eight months ago. Well, I say when we left. We left originally, but then... Didn't exactly have the choice to come back. It, it really looks worse than it did when we left. It's overgrown, and... Tch, half of the building is... All the paint is coming off, and... Jeez. Okay. Stick close, okay? You gotta be careful. Don't know where Reed is, he could be anywhere. Okay, we're good. Okay, let's check his office. Okay. Nothing, he's not in there. Okay. Yeah, this place has really seen better days. It seems like they haven't been too worried about the upkeep of this place, just keeping everyone in. Um, okay, which door, left or right? TJ, you with me? Left? Okay, I'll open the door, okay? You get your gun at the ready, okay? Ready? Three, two, one. <coughs> okay, let's try that again, okay? Three, two, one. <coughs> what is up with these doors? Are they locked from the other side? I'm going to have to slam into him, okay? This isn't going to go as I planned. It's going to be a little bit loud, but okay. Three, two, one. <coughs> okay. Um, I don't see anyone. I think we're good. I think we're good. Okay. Um, to the right, no one. To the left, and... <sighs> okay, you with me, TJ? Caitlin, <laughs> and Carrie, and everyone. <laughs> hey, Brent. Shh. Hey, I, I, I thought you were dead. <laughs> That's what Reed wanted you to think. Where is he? He's in the playground. How did you get in here? Well, let us in. Okay, but you gotta keep that secret. Reed got Jonah and Josie killed. He said they went out for some supplies for the baby and got attacked by bandits. Well, he lied. Okay, just like he lied about what happened to us. What did happen? Why didn't you come back and what happened to your hair? I see you're asking the important questions. Um, I'll, I'll explain later, okay? Right now, I need to handle Reed. We need to help Drake. I know. Okay, Reed has him in a cell, I understand, but we'll let him out once we have Reed under control because it's pointless letting him out if when we come out, Reed just puts us all back in one. 
I, I missed you, Brent. I missed you too. For now, stay here, okay? I'll be back. TJ, you too. Wait, I, I wanted to stay with you. I know you did, okay? But I need you to help protect everyone, all right? You're good with a gun. Getting better with a knife. So it's... I, I, I want you here. <sighs> okay, yeah. I, I can do that. Good man, okay? I'll be back soon, okay? If you just stand on guard, right? Keep an eye out for anyone. All right? <laughs> hey, Carrie. Is that Rex? <laughs> wow. Well, seems he recognizes me. Gave me one of those head nods, which is sort of a sign of approval, I guess. I'll be back, okay? If anything goes wrong, get Primo, okay? And get everyone else out, I guess. Okay, so... Caitlin said reads out here, so... Let's see. Um, man, this place has really gotten overgrown. The grass is so tall. Um, okay. Ah! That's got to be... That's definitely him. Unless they got a new member, which I highly doubt, with the same hairstyle as Reed, but... Okay, let's get behind these logs. This place really hasn't changed much. Well, I say it hasn't changed much, it looks the same, just just... Not as well kept as it was when I left, so... Okay, now, I don't... Okay, yeah. Is that Willis, I think? Yeah, he sees me. But he's not informing Reed. Okay. Well, okay. Th this is this is good. This could work in my favour if... <sighs> this is a thing with leading with fear. People betray you. And people aren't loyal to you if they get the chance not to be. So, what Reed's going for here isn't working out. They can see me sneaking up on Reed right now and they are not saying a thing. Okay, so Reed is right there. I think I'm gonna have to crawl through the grass just to get up behind him. How am I gonna how am I gonna do this? If they don't tell him I'm behind him, that's gonna be great because it doesn't alert him to what's going on. Um I would say I could probably jump up behind him, hit him in the head, but I don't think I could knock him out in one hit. Maybe it's best to grab him and then Hit him? I don't know. Okay. We'll figure it out, right? Drop to the ground. Okay. Let's crawl through this grass. Okay. Gotta go quietly now. Right. Okay. Let's see him up ahead. Um, we'll use the back of the knife to knock him out. Actually, let's use the binocular. Nah. Let's use the... We'll use the end of the knife. It's sort of blunt there, so hopefully that should help once we grab him. Okay. Okay. I think it worked. Okay, let's grab his gun. Thank you for... Okay. I hope you all remember me. <laughs> it's good to see you all. Okay. I could use a little bit of help tying him up and getting him down into one of those cells. <sighs> okay. Looks like Primo was right. She did have a good feeling about this.